In this problem, y equals 1 over 1 plus c1 e to the negative x is a one parameter family of solutions of the DE, and here it is y prime equals y minus y squared. Find a solution of the first order initial value problem, that's what IVP stands for, consisting of this differential equation and the given initial condition. Right, so uh, the DE you see here, y prime equals y minus y squared together with this initial condition is called an initial value problem. So if you were to use some math and solve this differential equation, the answer you would get is right here, this y equals uh, 1 over 1 plus c1 e to the negative x. So let me go ahead and write that down. So y equals 1 over 1 plus c1 e to the negative x. This is called a one parameter family of solutions. And the reason is, you have one parameter, C1 is your parameter. So this is actually infinitely many solutions. Uh, there's a solution for various choices of C1, and there's probably infinitely many. So we have to find a specific one. We have to find the one that satisfies this condition, y of 0 equals negative 1 7 So we have to pick one from this infinite family of solutions. The answer we get is called a particular solution because we're picking a particular one from this infinite family. Okay, so to do this, all we have to do is just replace the x with the x and y with y. So this is your y value. So negative 1 7th equals 1 over. And then we have 1 plus c1. And then x is actually equal to 0. So this is e to the 0. So then we have negative 1 over 7 equals 1 over 1 plus c1. And that's because e to the 0 is equal to 1. All right, we're looking for c1. So now we can just maybe, uh, we could cross multiply. Let's do that. So cross, cross. So we get negative 1 plus c1 equals 7, right? 7 times 1 is 7. Let's keep going. So we have negative 1 minus c1 equals 7. Adding 1 to both sides, we get negative c1 equals 8. So that means that c sub 1 is equal to negative 8. So now all we have to do is take this and plug it back into our one parameter family, which was y equals 1 over 1 plus c1 e to the negative x. So plugging in uh, c1 here, we would get y equals 1 over 1, and then c1 is negative 8, so minus 8 e to the negative x. So this is a solution to the initial value problem. So again, if you solve this differential equation here using some math, this is a, uh, a nonlinear equation actually. Actually, this is something called a Bernoulli differential equation. Yeah, it is. So later on, as you continue to study differential equations, you'll learn how, how to solve this. So if you solve this, um, you will get uh, this here. And then you use this condition to pick a particular solution from this infinite family. So, so in the box, you would just type in 1 over 1 minus 8 e to the negative x. And that's it. I hope this video has been helpful.